Good evening, Paul here, down by Lake Macquarie, New South Wales, where we camped right on the waterfront so that we can spend some time in the Lord's presence. And to do that, we also get into His Word. So the this afternoon we're going to spend some time looking at Psalm 119. Reading from verse 1. Blessed are those whose ways are blameless, who walk according to the law of the Lord. Blessed are those who keep his statutes and seek him with all their heart. They do no wrong, but follow his ways. You have laid down precepts that are to be fully obeyed, Oh, that my ways were steadfast in obeying your decrees. And that's my plea, Lord. And as, as it is for David, who's writing this beautiful psalm, then I would not be put to shame. When I consider all your commands, I will praise you with an upright heart. As I learn your righteous laws, I will obey your decrees. Do not utterly forsake me. Oh Lord. Verse 9. How can a young person stay on the path of purity by living according to your word? I seek you with all my heart. Do not let me stray from your commands. I've hidden your word in my heart that I might not sin against you. Praise be to you, Lord. Teach me your decrees. With my lips I recount all the laws that come from your mouth. I rejoice in following your statutes as one rejoices in great riches. I meditate on your precepts and consider your ways. I delight in your decrees. I will not neglect your word. Be good to your servant while I live that I may obey your word. Open my eyes that I may see wonderful things in your law. I am a stranger on earth. Do not hide your commands from me. My soul is consumed with longing for your laws at all time. You rebuke the arrogant who are accursed, those who stray from your commands. Remove me from their scorn and contempt, for I keep your statutes. Though rulers sit together and slander me, your servant will meditate on your decrees, your statutes, are my delight. Wow. Here is a man writing from a yearning, a deep yearning in his heart to be uh, right with God, to follow his ways, follow his laws. And he, and he goes on, it's quite a long psalm. I am laid low in the dust. Preserve my life according to your word. I gave an account of my ways and you answered me. Teach me your decrees. Cause me to understand the way of your precepts that I may meditate on your wonderful deeds. And so it goes on, you know. There's so many wonderful things in the word of God. It is inspired by the Holy Spirit. It's given to us as a lamp unto our feet and a light unto our path. And the greatest laws, of course, come from Jesus Christ himself, who says, love the Lord your God with all your heart and lean not on your own understanding. In all your ways, acknowledge him and he will direct your paths. Nothing better than spending time with God in his word. You get into the word. And may the word get into you. You have a great day. See you later.